Quote, it's the least I can do, said Joe, after we stole all their land. <laughs> On Tuesday, the president hosted a forum about artificial intelligence with tech leaders in SF. When asked what the most positive part of the trip was, he said, I guess being in a city where nobody yelled at me for taking a dump on the sidewalk. <laughs> it's funny because it's true. Sausage maker Johnsonville is recalling more than 42,000 pounds of pork sausage for possible contamination with plastic fibers. Fortunately, authorities were able to track all 42,000 pounds to a single location in New York City. <laughs> you people, disgusting. A Florida woman wearing only a towel and drinking a four loco, <laughs> stop me there, <laughs> was arrested for allegedly letting kids photograph her naked in a Dollar General parking lot. <laughs> She's since been promoted to head of Florida tourism. <laughs> yeah. Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny premiered in L.A. this week. I don't want to give away the plot, but the ancient relic he's looking for this time is horrifying. <laughs> Good news for the Oakland A's. Nevada just approved $380 million to build a new stadium in Las Vegas. It will be just like the regular stadium, except fans will be able to buy hookers. <laughs> Inside and outside, which is great. The section of I-95 in Philly that collapsed will reopen within two weeks, which means Pennsylvania can now focus their efforts on rebuilding another total disaster. <laughs> It was revealed recently that the U.S. ranks 60th in the world in penis size. It would have been even higher, but the average was thrown off by a single participant. <laughs> I don't know if that means higher or lower. I think higher means lower, or does higher mean upper, or lower mean bad? No matter how you swing it, they got you. Yeah. <laughs> True. A there. British family was stunned after its pet tortoise was found miles from home after missing for two years. When asked for an explanation, the tortoise said, I have no idea. It all happened so fast. <laughs> An LAPD drug dog is being hailed as a hero after sniffing out 15 pounds of heroin, a kilogram of fentanyl, and an assault rifle that were inside a vending machine. So one thing we can all agree on, that's... One hell of a vending machine. <laughs> we need one of those. According to an IRS whistleblower, Hunter Biden made improper tax deductions on tens of thousands of dollars he spent on hookers and a sex club. Wait, you mean I'm supposed to pay taxes on that stuff? <laughs> you know, as for sex clubs, I keep mine in the glove compartment. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. I, it took a second. Terrible. Club. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Clever. Yes. <laughs> the same four <laughs> transit cops nabbed an accused murderer and suspected serial slasher in NYC in a 24 hour period. Advocates of defunding the police responded, saying, See, we only need four cops. <laughs> that was cute. <laughs> What's wrong with you people? No! Nope. I don't want your sympathy, Clafter. <laughs> I'm not, uh, whatever that other show is. Okay, finally, math and reading scores for 13-year-olds in the U.S. have hit the lowest levels in decades. But don't worry, those kids have no idea what that even means. <laughs> All right. Clap for the illiterate children.